what is going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back to a brand new series here on my channel welcome to the start of the sims 4 series here and um yeah i've been thinking of making a sims 4 series for a while dude but like as you can see obviously i am starting a little bit late here and the reason for that is because as you can see i have a big ish house already um, and the reason for that is basically because the process of the career that I chose, and as you can see, my guy starts for work in one hour. He is a esports gamer. I chose the tech guru uh, path for my player here. Um, and uh, just the process of getting raises and promotions and all that was was really boring. My guy would just come home, play games, go on the computer, do programming, and. Um, it was just pretty much a repeat of that for days and days and days on end um, in The Sims. And, you know, I didn't really want to keep on having episodes where it was just me doing all that because I felt like it would get pretty boring, to be honest. And, um, yeah, so that's why I sort of started it somewhat late. Um, there's still time to, you know, improve my guy's, you know, career and stuff. The girl that I'm with. Apparently she's at she's supposed to be at work. I don't know why she's at home here. Um, it says I work until nine. For some reason she's here on the treadmill, and um, yeah. Um, so basically, my guy works in 13 minutes. Uh, this is the house. Um, let me give you a bit of a tour since it's just the first episode. I guess it's kind of just you know uh introducing the characters and whatnot so this is my character as you could see and as you could probably tell from the thumbnail um let's see here where i could show you my stuff uh my skills got a charisma level five comedy level three my main one is cooking which is level nine uh my handiness which is level five my cr programming which is maxed out at 10 my video gaming which is maxed out at 10 and uh, i could do you know, live streaming, my guy is a professional esports gamer, which I wish I was at in real life, that'd be really fun, but uh, as you can see, my guy is able to live stream different types of games and get donations, so he gets money while live streaming, which is good because my daily task is li uh, playing video games uh, daily, so when I come home, I just do some daily live streams and my guy can go ahead and make some money like that. Uh, as you can see, we have a child now, dude. Like, hell yeah. We decided, I decided to name Miles. I was going through the, uh, randomizing names. And Miles came up. Uh, as you can see, my character's name is, uh, Brandon Gonzalez. Which is my real name, if you didn't know that. Now you do. Um, and the girlfriend. The girl that I'm dating is, uh, Summer Holiday. Um, just look at her. She's so amazing. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we have a kid, Miles Gonzalez. Uh, I was doing the randomizing baby name, and Miles came off as my guy is going off to work, as you can see in the top right corner. Um, Miles came up, and I thought that was just a really, really, you know, that, was, that sounded like a good name, Miles Gonzalez. I mean, I don't know. So, yeah, uh, this is the house from the outside. It looks quite nice, and I am actually proud of myself, because, uh... Well, like, look at the house, dude, that's crazy. With no cheats, no nothing, it was just pure grinding my guy's, um, you know, career and promotions and whatnot. And, um, glad because it started off as just this little square right here. Not even this add-on on this side, it was just this square. I had a kitchen, living room, bed, uh, and I had an upstairs for just, like, bathroom and that's it, but, like... Pretty much, I went from this little square to this massive house, and uh, let me give you just a little tour, even though I've been sort of showing you guys the whole house, pretty much the whole episode. Um, this is the front, and uh, I've had to watch a YouTube video on how to make like porches and fronts like that, but that's pretty much like all I've done for the YouTube watching to get, you know, like, um, inspiration, I guess you could say, for the house build. Or just like tips and tricks on how to do certain things and whatnot. So this is obviously the main part of the house. This is the kitchen slash living room area. And um, I don't know, man. I'm actually quite proud of my interior designing. I think it's pretty, pretty good as well as my exterior designing. We have a goldfish here and um, you could probably guess where I got them. I named them the snack that smiles back because it's a goldfish. And 
you know, because of the goldfish. Um, do we, the commercials, the snack that smells bad, goldfish. Got a fireplace and a flat screen TV over here with uh, a nice, like, blue, dark blue design going on over here with, in the kitchen, it's a nice, like, gold white design. And uh, pretty much the whole interior of the house is white. Uh, over here we have my guy's own uh, office. Yeah, office. And uh, I've locked the door so only my guy can go in. Which is uh, which is perfect because I hated when people would come in. And especially the girl that I'm dating. And come and talk to me while I'm trying to do programming or whatever. But uh, all the stuff in here is pretty much stuff I've gotten from my work. Aside from the tables and the computer chair. Everything else here is from my work and the wallpaper, obviously. The couch was from my like promotions and work or whatever. The computer was from the, these two trophies. Uh, and this uh, sort of like... Mm, I don't know what you call it. But I got it from dating. Uh, doing a successful date with summer holiday and um yeah so that is my personal office uh i don't know i just really like the design nice simple and clean as well as the uh main area of the house and then we move on to upstairs here um we have the bathroom you know nothing too special over here uh moving down over here is this used to be my office oh i guess she's going to work now and she is a lot of hours late she was supposed to start work at 1, she's going at 6, so I don't know what's going on over there. Um, this used to be my office until I moved it to down here, obviously. So this is Summer's uh, little office because she is a short story writer, so obviously she, she's an author. She needs a computer, you know, a little workspace for her. So this is what I built her, and um, stuff in here is from her work also. Like, I think this thing on the wall right here is from her work, this painting. Uh, that was on this wall right over here. Uh, the computer is not. Um, this chair is also. So, you know, a couple of things, a couple of achievements in her little office space right here. This is the kids' room, as you can see. I've shown you this pretty much already when I was showing you my little kid, Miles. Um, yeah, nothing too, you know, big here. Just like a normal kids' room. Uh, and then we go on to the master bedroom, which I feel like I designed pretty pretty nice if I do say so myself we got a you know a blue uh you know yeah blue blackish design going on in this bedroom uh got a little rose here that I got from a date a little nice uh stuffed animal on top of the dresser over here uh a king size bed um you know some nightstands with lights a nice painting and a great view of the front and the back side of the house here and that's pretty much it for outside um, and we move on to the outside uh, we have a pathway going leading up to the house a pathway leading up to the backyard and another pathway from the kitchen to the backyard because she's she's still here I don't know what she's doing here she's just doesn't want to go to work for some reason um, but yeah, uh, here is another pathway, and my guy gets a nice view also of the front and the back from his office. Uh, we got a little, like, porch patio back here. Uh, we got, you know, like, the the seats for outside if you want to, you know, grill up some, I don't know, burgers. And <laughs> have, like, a, you know, a nice family, like, gathering or get-together, whatever. You can have it back here. Uh, a nice little bench. Oh, she got promoted. She came back from work, but she wasn't even at work. Summer's been promoted to novelist. She'll now make an additional 55 per hour for a grand total of 115 per hour. She also gets a bonus of 1,253 simoleons. So that is nice to see. Summer holiday got a raise and she hasn't even been at work. So where even is she? Uh, she's in the bathtub showering with her work clothes on so obviously there's a little glitch going on over here hopefully that gets fixed quite soon but that's always nice to see a nice little promotion for my sims which we will get more into detail next episode i guess this is just the intro episode and um just a nice little pool back here little family pool that you can uh get together and just relax you know on some nice vacation days i don't know <laughs> but uh yeah that is pretty much it my guy's still at work oh my baby is upset he needs to get his diaper changed so we will go and do that right now where is she there she is oh it's not glitched she was supposed to be at work hopefully this is just a one-time thing 
and uh yeah let's go take care of our little child our little one and uh, let's also feed him i don't believe he's been fed let's bottle feed him not breastfeed him for now and uh yeah this is my little boy as you can see <laughs> this little alien looking like baby hopefully will soon turn out to be a good looking kid I will age him up at some point, I just, I'm not sure when. Uh, but yeah, it's Miles, Brandon, oh my guy's back from work and I earned a raise as well, dude, hell yeah. So, Brandon has been given a raise as, as champion gamer for superior work performance because I'm a god. I will now earn an additional 11 for a total of 404 per hour, which is huge. I also got a, a, a bonus of 1,664 simoleons, which is good. And as you can see, the bottom left, that I am pretty stacked, dude, I'm not even gonna lie. All the saving and all the, you know, the hard extra work has really, really paid off. Uh, let's just go get my guy in, oh, the bathroom actually he has to use. And also, uh, let's get him some leftover food for after he's done in the bathroom. So that's always nice to see, I've earned a raise. St the, tack, the, blah, the task still stays the same at playing video games. And uh, my next work day is in three days, so that is great to see. I get a couple of days off before I go back to work, which is always nice to see. And a promotion, which is really, really good. I just love those promotions, man. But uh, yeah, I think that's it gonna be it. That's gonna be it for this episode. It's just a little um, intro to the series and explaining why I started it late, why I'm doing what I'm doing. Introducing the two main people of the series, hopefully he will be aged up, this little cute goblin, next episode. <laughs> Looks so cute when he sleeps, <laughs> and, and he got his little elephant toy right beside him. And um, yeah, so uh, I guess that'll do it for this episode. If you guys did enjoy it, I will see how it goes. It's gonna be not really a main type of series, but uh, if it gets like a good amount of like views, likes, that kind of stuff, then... I will have to upload it quite Whoa. frequently uh -oh. and quite often, so uh, hopefully this series gets a lot of love because, you know, I'm really excited for it and I enjoy playing this, so I might as well record it, right, you know, <laughs> and uh, hopefully you guys do enjoy it. So if you guys enjoyed this episode, please do leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I shall see you guys in another episode of my Sims Let's Play series very, very soon. See you guys.